Hola amigos, bienvenidos, eh, welcome to Mexico. In this video, I take you on a road trip from Belize to Mexico, where I show you some of the towns on the way, some border requirements, and a peak of Chetumal in Mexico. My name is Mickey. Keep watching. Hello everyone, Mickey here. Welcome to my channel where I draw lessons from life experience and I also share my experience of the places that I am working, which at the moment is Belize in Central America. So if you'd like to come on an experience journey with me whilst learning lessons, I'll please ask you to subscribe and become part of this wonderful family. Thank you very much. Let's get into the video. One good thing about living or visiting Belize is you drive a few hours up north and you hit the Mexican border. And behind that border is a whole new world and a whole new experience. So I want you to keep that in mind and I will be showing you just a day uh, some of the things in Chetumal in Mexico. So yeah, keep on enjoying. This is Orange Walk. Orange Walk is the fourth largest town in Belize. It is the capital of the Orange Walk district, 53 miles from the north of Belize city. Orange Walk is said to be ideal for visitors who want to experience nature, visit Mayan ruins and learn about the mestizo culture of Belize. Mestizos are the mixture of Europeans and indigenous Americans. Corazo 
in the north of Belize. There is this spot that I normally stop and then this is the scene that you can get in Corazo. Sometimes I just want to stay here and not move. Can we just stay here and enjoy this? But no, we have a journey to make, so let's go. Corazo is the northernmost town of Belize. It was once believed to be part of Chetima in Mexico. It is the capital of Corazo district and 84 miles north of Belize city. that I want to show you in Corazo and I want you to tell me if these people work nine to five jobs um, it's one thing that every time I reach this spot I look with the eye of envy but hey I'm not supposed to envy I'm supposed to appreciate so don't hate appreciate so I want to show you these houses look look it's, it's nice isn't it So yeah, let's keep on going. We're close to the border and I'll see you at the border. later and we are at the Belizean border and at this point you have to get out of your vehicle and then go inside and then get yourself booked out into Mexico so if you hold a British passport and you have a visa for for Belize you can go through to Mexico if you hold a Ghanaian passport apart from your visa for Belize you will need a visa for America or for Mexico so that's what you need um, I'm sure Belizeans don't need any visa. All they need is their Belize passport. So yeah, we go in and then we check in and then they will book us out and then we will drive into Mexico. Over here you can change your US dollars or Belizean dollars into peso. That is the currency for Mexico. If you think you don't have your visa card, your credit card, you can change your currency into peso so that you can get something to spend in Mexico.
left-hand side of the border and this bit can be a little bit tedious and annoying because after you've got down and gone to the Belizean side to do all your immigration card you have to get down at the Mexican side and do it all over again and normally if we did this on the weekend the queue over here will be enormous um, at least the queue over here is not it's not big so yeah we're done and we are entering Mexico now so keep on enjoying At this final point, you pay the border agencies 90 pesos, yes pesos, not dollars, so that your vehicle can be sprayed before you enter Mexico. Once that is done, you are free to enter Mexico. There you have it guys, we made it safely into Mexico. You must be tired right now, so we're going to stop the video right here and in my next video I am going to show you my shopping experience in Mexico and also show you around Chetumal in Mexico. I hope you enjoyed this journey and if you did remember to give the video a thumbs up and please subscribe if you are new to my channel to come on such journeys with me. Thank you very much for watching and see you in the next video. Oh,